kidney. 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 Uh, so he asked for $1.5 million or the kidney back because apparently she had a, an affair. Well, her name is Donnell Batista. She's 44. She's a good-looking woman. Now uh, speaking out against her ex-husband, Richard Batista, uh, after his news conference last week accusing her of adultery. Now listen to how good this gets. This should have been the Kane show uh, for the Roses. Apparently... She is accusing her husband, ex-husband, of being super suspicious. She calls him hyper suspicious. And that no adultery has ever taken place. Quote, he would rummage through her underwear drawer, sniffing her underwear to see if she cheated. Batista, a vascular surgeon at Nassau University Medical Center, said that his wife left him after having an affair with her physical therapist. Batista's uh, were both in court yesterday morning, never made eye contact throughout the proceeding. This is a man who put his life on the line uh, for his wife, and she treated him like a piece of dirt, said Richard Batista's lawyer, adding that his client has the right to speak publicly about what he'd been through. She's pissed because he starts talking about it. Now she's threatening to let everything out. This is why you don't do anything. This is why you don't do anything in the bedroom. Freaky, y'all. Because you never know if that marriage is going to last. Next thing you know, your wife's uh, going on TV saying that you smell her undies. And that uh, you do freaky stuff in the bedroom. Apparently, she's going to let it all hang out, no pun intended. Good for her. Uh, coming up soon. Is he getting back his kidney, though? Uh, no. no. no he's, he's trying to fight for the 1.5 mil. Uh, other insane lawsuits. Maybe we'll do this after 8 o'clock. Sarah, do you have the, the Hooters lawsuit where these guys are suing Hooters? For discrimination, right? Sexual discrimination or something? Yeah. Which, it's Hooters. You don't, yeah. it's not made for guys. You can't sue them for that. Pull it up, I'll get to that after okay. 8 o'clock today. No, I got it right here, never mind. Oh, good. I just happen to have it open at the same time. Uh, these guys are, uh, and, and Hooters isn't balking on this, uh, and they seem like desperate men. Nikolai Grushevsky uh, filed a class action lawsuit in Texas alleging they were denied a waiter's position because of gender. Yeah, really? You think? No ass. It's Hooters. You don't have boobs. Can't work it. The guys who call themselves the ruiners of all things good. That's the name of the group they apparently claim. Uh, is uh, claiming the Southwest Airlines defense, citing a three-decade-old case in where the airline uh, forced eventually to hire male flight attendants. I didn't know that. Do you know Southwest only hired females for a long time? Mm -mm. Apparently they did. The guys are asking the court for emotional damages, but uh, we don't think it's going to happen. Mike McNeil, the vice president of marketing for Hooters uh, of America, says the move is, of course, uh, questionable. Uh, why would a man want to be a Hooters girl? In our opinion, he doesn't, and he's simply looking for an opportunity to Impress. make some money. Cash in, yeah, That's exactly. exactly.